everyone it's Rita with everything homemade and I'm going to show you our favorite knot on the farm it's called the animal knot that's what I call it a lot of times people use this to tie up their horses because what makes this knot so important to know is that you can tie up any kind of animal whether it's a dog a horse um, your calves your cows even your donkey your goats your sheep you get the point with within a few moments the nice thing is is that it releases the knot really quickly so if you see sometimes movies or whatever where they just kind of the horse is tied up and they just like grab the lead and they just tug it a bit and it releases and they hop on the horse and go that's what I'm going to show you today and you can see here that I'm getting loved by Maple is that she's already tied I'm going to show you how to tie this knot. We really use this particular animal animal tie when we're doing maintenance in cages. So we don't got a lot of area to just move them to a side. So we tie them up to aid a thing we, we can secure so they're not running out so the tractor can do its work. Or maybe we're looking at one particular animal and another one is just kind of being nosy so we can actually securely tie them somewhere so they can mind their own business there but we can also safely work. Um, we bring in our milk cows, you know, for training cows, we can halt or, or bring them in, then tie them and it's just really quick and easy way to do it. So this is a rope here and you can see that if you look at this, well, how are you supposed to secure an animal, especially if we're talking about, you know, anything, you know, from a 50 pounds to a thousand pounds. Well, I've never had an animal come out of this and I've tied all my animals with these ties and even ones with training. So this is a very secure knot. So what you want to do is grab your rope. I'm going to just use a tree here and you can see you can make it however short you want it. So what you want to do with your right hand is grab this section of rope and make an eye. I call it an eye because what I'm going to do is flip this back and make a loop like this. And then what I want to do is I grab this section of rope and I go underneath and make another eye. So you have something that looks like this. Then I want to take the bottom eye and go through the top. And I make this one a little bigger for the moment. And what I like to do, you can actually leave it like this. But what I like to do is take the remaining rope and just go right through this eye and then pull it tight. So now there's no way she can go anywhere. So if you look on, look here, and I put all my weight here, this way it's totally secure. But then if I grab the, the rope that she's actually on and I do the opposite, What's going to happen is it just gets tighter and tighter. She can't move. So she would tug at this vigorously. She's like, what are you doing, lady? It's not going to go anywhere. The end, it doesn't tighten this knot. That's, that's so critical. The only way that this knot gets tighter is if I pull here. That's what's so beautiful. So now to let this go, it's just simply pulling at this tail and then like that tug it and everything comes out so you can tie up an animal really quickly and release them really quickly but they can't go anywhere so let me do that once more for you Sometimes it can catch you a little bit, just help it out and release. So that's how you do it. Now I'm going to get my daughter to do it too.
So now, Ocean, what I want you to do is show them how fast you can actually do that knot. Okay. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay, Ocean, that's pretty fast. Should we see how fast mom can do it? Sure. Sure? Yeah. Okay. Awesome. So once you get good at it, it only takes a matter of seconds to get your animals tied securely, easily, and where they're somewhere safe or wherever you need them to be. And it's just, it makes, it makes such a difference on our farm. Definitely does. And thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you on the next one.